working quickly. Corborn Jumpy is uh, back into 3.30. Green light goes on. Here's race two. The Metro Roller Doors maiden stake. Ready now. Set to go. Away. Shadow Star began fair. Let's look for an early leader. Shadow Star's hunting up on the inside, but Corborn Jumpy shows some dash and's got to get across and find the lead. Moving up on its outside was Alinga Frost. Behind those, starting to make ground about two lengths away now was Spring Vader. Side road and Shadow Star at the tail. Still in front, Corborn Jumpy, usually strong at the finish, getting away, and Corborn Jumpy goes on to beat Alinga Frost. Third was Spring Vader, fourth was Shadow Star, and side road at the tail end of the field. And the time was around 22.60. It was a better jump by Corborn Jumpy. He was up there vying for the lead and was strong at the finish at his most recent start here. So out in front, I think those that might suspect him would have been quite happy with themselves, on good terms with themselves. It's 6.84. 6.84 and 1, the judges' numbers. 6.84 and 1. 22.64 was the time. One and a quarter by one and a half. One and a quarter by one and a half with the margins. 5.16 and then 13.77. The run home was 8.89. 8.89 coming home. And uh, a good jump by Corborn Jumpy to get first prize. Tony Rasmussen with the first two winners here tonight. Corborn Jumpy, 3.80, A Linger Frost, 180. No third for Spring Vader. The Quinella, six and eight, eight dollars thirty. The exact the six and eight twelve dollars. The trifecta six eight four thirty one sixty. The first four six eight four one one hundred and forty one twenty.